Hi fairies and welcome back to my channel. It's Shannon here. I am really excited because today we are back with another thrift haul. I went to a new Goodwill on my way home from work and I found some really, really good stuff. And it was priced so cheap, I can't believe it. You know me, I am always hitting up a good deal at the thrift store and I love sharing my finds with you. If we get into the haul, make sure you subscribe to my channel. If you've not already, I would love to have you stick around, talk about thrifting, fashion, Fashion, makeup and lots of fun things on my channel. Why oh, my, my chair keeps spinning around on me. I can't stay in one spot. Anyways, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. I really appreciate it. Let's get into the finds. Okay, I'm gonna just start out with a bang with my favorite thing that I found. I think this is my favorite. So as we may know, fall is coming up. And as you also may know, I am obsessed with a good sweater. And I found this beautiful sweater. It's so big, I can barely fit it in the frame. How oh, pretty is this sweater? It looks so luxe and comfy. I absolutely love it. It's got like a belt tie around it. I love the earthy colors. I have to say it feels like the tiniest bit scratchy, but I think if I just wore like a long sleeve under it, it would be fine. I have to show you the tag on this. I feel like this just looks expensive. There is the tag. I love it. It looks so cute. What's it called? Ennington L Limited California. It is a size medium, 88% acrylic. It only smells like the thrift store, still I need to wash it. But how gorgeous is this? And just wait till you hear what I paid. Here's the tag. Whoever was pricing at this Goodwill has not caught on. <laughs> Everything was so cheap. This was only $3.99. I cannot believe this was only $3.99. I feel like I'm gonna wear this so much this fall, even like as a coat. I think it's just so gorgeous and I love it. Let's move on. Okay, next up we have this cute little top. I debated on getting this, but for some reason it just kind of spoke to me and I thought it was cute. It's like a little gingham top with some ruching at the top and then it kind of flares out. I thought it looked really flattering when I tried it on. It just kind of gave me like, I don't know, like cute little cottage, like picnic type feelings. And I thought this would be cute. Like you could either dress it up or down. The brand is called Urban Romantics and it's a size small. This was $3.99. I can't believe this was the same price as that sweater. I just, I don't get it, but whatever. Let's not question it too much. I thought it was cute. I hope I can still find time to wear it before the weather changes. And if not, I thought I could layer like with a cardigan or something as well. I debated on getting this too, but I just went ahead and grabbed it because I was in the shopping spirit. But I got this striped little crop top. I thought this kind of had like a cool like 70s kind of vintage look to it. I thought it was cute. I like a good stripe every now and again. This was $3.99. It's a size small. Brand is called Me To We Essentials. Also felt like it kind of had that like 90s, early 2000s kind of style that's coming back right now. And I just thought it was cute. A little tight, but I think I can make it work. I thought it would look cute with like a jumper overalls or something like that. Also pretty soft too. So I couldn't pass this up. I am admittedly a huge Harry Potter fan. The books definitely more than the movies. If you've read the books, please do. They're, they're really good. Um, anyways, I got a Harry Potter shirt. It has like the Hogwarts logo on it with the four houses. And then on the back, it says Hogwarts. Just thought this would be nice just to like wear around the house for just like a comfy t-shirt. Oh, it says it's from Wizarding World at Universal Studios. It's a size medium. Never gotten to go, but I really wanna go to the Wizarding World. That's like a bucket list for me to get there, but I just thought it was cute and made me happy. Which was this? I can't find the tag. Well, the tag has disappeared. Where did I put the receipt? I had the receipt tucked. I don't know. I think it might have been like around three or four dollars. I really can't tell, but it wasn't like super expensive. Let's get into a couple home goods really quick that I grabbed. Honest to God, I don't know what got into me and why I bought this, but I bought this 
a mug with rabbits on it. I just thought it was so goofy and I thought the handle was so funny. It was only 99 cents. No, it was 79 cents. It still has a tag on it from another store that says 99 cents. I had room in our cupboard for one more cup, so I just grabbed this. I thought it was cute. I like stuff with bunnies on it. It kind of made me smile. Next up, not very exciting, but I bought this ceramic mixing bowl. It was only a dollar and nine cents, and I just thought it would be a nice bowl to add to our kitchen for baking and stuff like that. Now I think I have kind of like one of each size, like a large, medium, and small bowl. I also grabbed this serving tray. I don't know why this just like really caught my attention with the green swirl. I thought this would be cute for like parties or maybe around the holidays, even with the green color. We have guests over. It was only a dollar and nine cents as well, so not a huge investment, but I thought I could get some use out of it. it definitely needs washed. That's, that's for sure. It's kind of dirty. Definitely wash it before I use it for sure. Next up, I bought a crock pot. I just thought this was like the cutest crock pot for some reason. I love the little flowers on it. It's still in really good shape, even though it looks old, like the lid is good. Crock inside is still intact. I plugged it in and it does work. So I like making stuff in crock pots just for like, simple meals. This was only $3.39, so I'm kind of glad I grabbed this. I'm excited to cook in this. I just think it has like a really cute vintage vibe to it, and I think it'll match some other stuff in our kitchen. Okay, moving right along with some more clothes. The reason I just kind of like this kind of like sporty sweatshirt thing, it says Colorado State Rams on the back and it has like a little embroidered ram on it. I thought this was cute for like, maybe like watching sports or just like going to walk in the park in the fall. Thought it was a cute color. God, why won't my chair stop spinning around? It's only $3.99 and I tried it on and I, it just like made me feel cute and like kind of sporty for a change. So I thought I would give it a try. I, I like it. Also grabbed this flannel. It's kind of like a longer flannel. I thought the colors looked pretty. I thought it looked nice and comfy. It was like mostly cotton, which I liked as well. Part of the reason I got this was for work in the fall because we wear like t-shirts with our logo on it, but I noticed a lot of the other girls like to wear flannels over top and it looked really cute and I don't have too many, so I thought this would be nice to just like throw on this fall. This was $3.99 as well. Prices were just so good on everything and they had a lot of nice stuff there. I was impressed. But yeah, this flannel I thought was cute. All right, and the last thing I got was this huge white felt jacket. And the reason why I got this was for the fabric. I love working with felt and especially white is a color that's really hard to find. Back when I was doing my handmade business, I would have literally freaked out if I saw this. I think that was part of the reason why I had to get it because it's just like so much white felt. I'm kind of getting like a bug to get back into some sewing and creating again. So I just went ahead and grabbed this because it was like so nice and I'll probably end up cutting it up. It was $5.99, it is a women's 3X. So I'm excited to be able to use this to make some like moon patches again and things like that. All right, everybody, that does it for this haul. Not a crazy amount of stuff, but I feel like I found some really cool pieces that I think I will really enjoy wearing and they were all priced very well. I just love thrift shopping so much. It's just like such a fun way to go unwind and just like peruse around and see what kind of treasures you can find. Make sure you're subscribed and give this a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I really, really do appreciate it. I will see you next Sunday for my next video. And remember, you are beautiful, special, and magical, and I love you so much. Bye, everyone.